Oh, look, guys, you'll see we are at the Dollar Tree. Yeah, I thought we deserved another field trip. And, well, since we go to the Dollar General all the time, we'd go somewhere else and see what kind of awesome things they've got. Because they get new, different stuff all the time. And sometimes, guys, well, if you've not been to the Dollar Tree lately, you want to go. And you know you want to know. So go ahead, get a video a thumbs up. And share with your friends. And, well, let's go on in. We're going to go with this one. It's kind of generic. It just says Happy Valentine's. <laughs> I wonder how many of those duos would fit in here. That's my phone telling me it's an awesome idea. Oh, how country and cute. Look, guys, these are some of the things you could fill the jars with. Really cute. Just scatter them in the jars to go with the theme of what we're doing. I think I might get one. Just kind of mix in with what I've got. <laughs> and look, <laughs> if you wanted to just, yeah, use these. Actually, if you had them, I would just use the plastic knives. Ah, this is what I come for. For some ribbon. Yes. Oh. Yes, right here. I picked you. <laughs> That's just too dang cute. So we got some of that. Uh, I'm getting crap overload here because look at these. <laughs> now these ones right here would be something that I would put in the mailbox along with whatever snacks you're going to put in the mailbox or candy. I would throw these in there with that. just for fun and to be cute. I mean, awesome craft ideas, guys. I mean, there's so many crafts that can be done for the kids. Okay, what we got down here? Oh, now that's kind of cute. That is kind of cute. And, I mean, it just goes to show you, we can make these things as elaborate as we want. Next, we got to get something to go in the middle of our bouquet. And look. <laughs> look what we got. We got all kinds of these to choose from. They're a dollar. Okay, let's see what other kind of goodies they got. And I'm 
and this is some alternate things that you could use. You could use the Andre's Mint. You could use the Kisses. So my suggestion if you want to use these is to get the bigger bag and do the DG deal with the Kisses. But this is the Godiva I was telling you about. This has the velvety dark filling. Belgium chocolate imported. Yeah, good stuff. They also have Russell Stouffer candy here as well. Name brand, a dollar. They've got the mint patties and the Russell Stouffer's. Again, name brand. Mix and match your own candy boxes. We got fragrant oils, guys. Rose and apricot fragrant oils. And a little candle making set. Do it yourself candle making set. Wow. I'm going to get one of these for my granddaughter. birthday. Often crafty things. Her mother loves candles. So this would be a way for her to do a craft. She's homeschooled so it can be considered an art craft. <laughs> Triple duty guys. And she can give it to her mother for Mother's Day. Yeah. Let's see what other kind of stuff they have. Oh guys. Let's talk. Emergency candles. Okay, emergency candles. These are already contained. I don't know how far down they will burn, though. But these valet candles, awesome emergency candles. And let me tell you a little something about these taper candles. If you put them in the freezer prior to using them, they will burn slower. Okay, increases the burn time. Oh, and look, salted watermelon in a little jar. I mean, if you wanted to make baskets for your diabetic friends that don't do candy. Or just add something different, extra to your baskets. Look at these awesome little... I mean, these look high end to me. Really, they do. And they double duty. Because after you get done with the candle, you've got an awesome storage jar. Look at these cute little candles. Mm -hmm. Of course, we got little furry dillies. And we've got some bath bombs for the kids. If you want to make little baskets for Valentine's for your kids. Oh my god, all kinds of little bath bombs. I might have to make Valentine's baskets for my grandkids, just because. And this stuff, guys, I'm really loving this. I love the packaging. Okay. And uh, there's a product, and when I see it, I'll show it to you, that I've been using that I really like, and it's from here. And look, we've got more bath bombs. <laughs> And I just want to let you know that if you want to do a bigger one, I think we could do a bouquet of bath bombs. Yeah, I think we could do a bouquet of bath bombs. Look at her flat heart bath bombs. We've got our mason jar, but look, guys. Oh, my gosh. And that's double duty because you could use it as a drinking glass. Look at the tubs. Imagine what you could do with that. Uh, yeah. 
We are basket making mamas. I am just, mm, I'm intrigued with this. Really, I am. I like my mason jar deal. I really do. But, yeah, that's an option right here, guys. This is a beautiful option. And if you want to make your own candy boxes by using fun size candies, these are beautiful. Pair it up with a small Valentine's card. Same goes for these tall red ones right here. Just fill her up with their favorite candy. Okay. Here is a variety of different type of wide mouth bases that you could use to make your bouquet. Personally, I like the mason jars. For one, they're a little bit tougher. Uh, uh, can upstand a little bit more. And of course, I think you can get those from here as well. Okay. Cute little glasses. Hmm. And of course, if you want to, you can just use, I would go with these because they're longer, these wooden dowels to make your bouquet sticks. And of course, if you want to paint them, you can paint them. Like I said, you can make this stuff as elaborate as you like. I love all the craft stuff they have for a dollar. This is it, guys. One of the main reasons why I come here for my Lunchables. They're a dollar. You automatically save 35 cents each. But I want you to look. They have a new product. It's Mrs. Builds Chocolate Chip place and bake cookies you get six for a dollar of fresh baked cookie dough i mean awesome got oscar meyer cotto salami and bologna oscar meyer <sighs> yeah gets better yep and of course the cheese the cheese is really good guys his dollar slabs of cheese is really good your juices and your waters, guys, for one person. Hey, great deal. This water right here is some really good water. And, uh, well, even that beats the Ozarka deal at the Dollar G. Yeah. Got some pH balance big bottles of water now here. This is a new product for a dollar. Got the four packs of Shasta Colas for a dollar. That's a quarter of soda, guys. And of course, if you're, you know, one person, look. Oh my gosh, I wonder. I wonder if our quarter coupon will work on this one roll of Charmin. It says that one mega roll equals four regular rolls. Huh. Yeah. That means that would be 75 cents. Still. Huh. Interesting. <laughs> and up above, you got some thousand sheep for a dollar. Four of those be four dollars. That's about right. Nothing really cheap about that, except for in a pinch, you don't have to buy four rolls. You can just buy one. Oh, we got dollar boxes of puffs. Hmm, maybe we get some paper coupons, and we got dollar boxes of Kleenex. We do have a paper coupon for that. I'll have to check that one out and see what it says. If it says any Kleenexes. Hmm. OMG guys 
long grain brown rice. This is survival stuff right here, guys, for a dollar. Pick you up two or three of these. They've got the white rice, too. You can mix these together, and you can store them in clean, dry, two-liter soda bottles. They'll store for years just like that. What else we got? Little Hungry Jack mashed potato servings. Okay. If you are one person, okay, and don't, or don't eat at home a lot, but you don't want to spend a dollar for one little single serving container, well, there you go. Okay. A lot of spices. Apple cider vinegar. You always want to have some of that in your emergency stock. Oh, look. Raw, unfiltered apple cider vinegar. Got some marinades. And look. Asparagus, a flippin' dollar. Bullseye, barbecue sauce, a dollar. Got dollar olives, jalapenos. All of this is just put up food, guys. This is simply put up food. So, even if you don't care to eat this stuff on a regular basis... Which is really probably for the best because you'd eat it up. This is emergency food stuff that I actually could keep you alive. And we're now at the Dollar General. We did complete our transactions at the Dollar Tree. And well, when we get home, we'll show you what all we got. But right now we're going into the Dollar Tree. Excuse me, Dollar General. Because I was going through my cues. And I come across a bunch of food cues that I have yet to use. So we're going to go in and I'm going to use them. So if you've not used those food coupons yet, it's time to, well, let's go use them. Turning out to be a beautiful day. Look at that. Blue skies. Yeah. 